Here we are in beautiful Arizona, Phoenix. There's Dylan going by the pool in the backyard of the Airbnb. There's Meg. Hi, Meg. Hi. Hi, Linda. Hi. What you guys doing today? Celebrating Matthew and Katie's wedding. All October right. 24th, 2020. Thank you. So we're going to Matthew's wedding area. Yeah. Out here by the mountains and the deserts. In Arizona, all kinds of things around. It's a very nice. good description. Nice. Linda, are you back there? Oh yeah, there's Linda and Matthew. Man. I'm That's Dylan. You're Dylan and <laughs> Megan. I don't even know who kids are. They all look the same. People walking. There's people. You guys look beautiful. So where are you at? What day is it? There's a mountain. Nice. Here's a mountain. There's Kay. The first time we've seen her all day. Look at her. Oh! First time we've seen her. A little bit this way. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I get the area to go back. Oh, yes. <laughs> Is he nervous? He sounded nervous. This will be the first time Matthew sees Katie all day. Yes, he did cry. Thanks for not looking. Thanks for not looking on me. So I'm not sure how to put it on. Should I just put it like in here? Sure. Is that okay? Look at you two sitting out here in the desert. Beautiful. So they had their iTunes going. Good 
afternoon. We have come here to mark a very special day in the lives of Matthew and Caitlin. This is the moment when their two pasts, which have already traveled side by side, will now and forever move forward always as one. Through their time together, they have come to realize that their personal dreams, hopes, and goals are more attainable and more meaningful through the combined effort and mutual support provided in love, commitment, and Today, family, surrounded by the people that they love the most. Who brings the bride, Caitlin, to stand beside her groom, Matthew? We do. We do. Matthew and Caitlin have had a long journey to get to where they stand today. They met the modern way online, and Caitlin was impressed that Matthew used correct grammar and spelling. Their first date was casual, but the chemistry was there. More dates followed where they got to know each other. As their relationship progressed, they both realized that they could be themselves around each other, act goofy, and rely upon each other. Their friendship also grew. When both realized they couldn't imagine a future without each other, they knew they were destined to be together. They were engaged in June of 2019 in Iceland. Matthew planned to hike for them at Mount, I'm not sure if you're Estra, just outside the city of Ray and you love that she's a feminist. Caitlin, Matthew <laughs> loves that you are so outgoing bubbly and easy to get along with. He loves that you can talk to anyone. He loves your sense of humor and how you can make him laugh. He loves your positivity and support. He loves your family values and how your family has molded you into the woman you are today. He loves your inner and outer beauty. He just really loves you. You both look- Make me laugh. I fell in love with you for so many reasons, but I knew that I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you because I found a partner and a best friend. Being with you has made me the happiest I've ever been in my life. Knowing I get to wake up next to you each morning, knowing I get to see you each day, at the end of the day... Couldn't fit him anywhere. <laughs> no pockets in your... No pockets. <laughs> Matt. You're my best friend, and today you become my husband. You're the most thoughtful man I've ever met. I love your kindness and empathy for other people. I love your sense of adventure. I love that we can roast each other and make fun of each other and make each other laugh every single day. Life with you has been so much fun, and I can't wait to see where it takes us together. I promise to be by your side through good times and the bad. I promise to be there to comfort you when you're anxious. I promise to travel the world with you. And I promise to make you a sandwich when you're hungry. <laughs> comfort, honor, respect, and care for her for the rest of your life. Caitlin, do you take Matthew to be your husband, promising to love him, comfort, honor, respect, and care for him for the rest of your life? I do. Matthew and Caitlin, you have shared your promises in our presence. Do you have a token which you wish to exchange as a symbol of those promises? <laughs> Wedding ring from our precious fire wearing them. Your rings say that even in your uniqueness, you have chosen to be bound together. Let these rings also be a sign that love has substance as well as a soul, a present as well as a past, and that despite its occasional sorrows, Love is a circle of happiness, wonder, and delight. May these rings remind you always of the vows you have taken here today. They remind you of who you are, where you've been, and where you are going. As you wear them through time, they will reflect not only who you are as individuals, but also who you are as a couple. Matthew, please give your ring to Kate. Hello. Oh no. 
it's oh. a pitcher. Oh, okay, good. Just a pitcher. Oh, no, he's taking days. I just want to be eating at our wedding. <laughs> You're, where, what day is it? October 24th. Fourth. I knew I was joking. Oh, right. Okay. And is there anything special about today, you guys? 2019? Is it 2019? Can we see your ring? That is gorgeous. He did good. Boy, whoever got you that must really love you. Mm. Nice. He's a lucky man. Nice. Very good. Well, congratulations, you guys. How's your first time in Arizona? It's, it's wonderful. You I like it? Arizona. Wow. You love Arizona? Wow. You love the mountains? It's a good place to come for a day. Oh, my God. That sounds like a perfect I love somebody, love somebody like Uh, well, so I don't have a speech prepared for this, but I wanted to thank each of you for coming out tonight. I know a lot of you have traveled many miles, some of you live in town here in Phoenix, but uh, obviously we have a pandemic going on. I wanted to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts for being here. You mean something to each of us, uh, family, friend, whatever it might be. But at the end of the day, you're here, we love you, and we can't thank you enough for being here. So again, thank you. Speak for me, I will. Take this. <laughs> no, I just wanted to thank everybody for being here. Also, I have family that traveled so far and friends that traveled so far, and you guys must really like us. So thank you. Um, it was, you know, obviously different than we expected. A little smaller, so you guys all made the cut. So congratulations. Uh, thank you for everybody for being here and. Uh, let's get on the dance floor. Open bar. Open bar. <laughs>